only 50% mass is not dependent on the other ones. And he indicates having 50% mass in radiation from any stream. This is the difference. From any stream, so he can get accretion in MSCIP program. It's a two-way program. So, <coughs> I think uh, most of the students uh, sitting here, they belong to MCA program, right? Anybody having any queries about MCA program? It's a three years program divided in six semesters, each semester of six months. Uh, in every semester, there are five theory papers and four labs. The last semester will be of uh, six months duration, only having project work. Uh, still waiting project. So, any student who clear all the five semesters, he can appear for six semester. This is must. You clear all your theory papers first before entering into the six semester. This is the main say, let's say foundation of really which it for six semester. semester uh, must have two internal assessments, assessments on the basis of regular studies and you have to appear in both the uh, assessments compulsorily. Uh, you have five theory papers in each semester of 100 marks each. So out of these uh, 100 marks, uh, there, are, there is a division of 80 and 20 marks. 80 marks will be given to your theory exam and 20 marks will be given to this true uh, internal assessment. Then uh, lab exercises have to be accomplished and demonstrated as a given schedule and time frame. Uh, in your entire semester, you will be given some assignments, practical assignments as well. So every student should complete those assignments and uh, you have to make a project on the basis of these assignments, your project file, your lab assignment file, that you have to submit at the time of the viva of your exam. So, so these are the five papers, five theory papers in semester one. The first paper is computer architecture. Uh, you can see on your uh, screen uh, one is the lecture and the uh, tutorial part and the practical part as well. Part as well. Uh, three credits, yeah, uh, three labs, three classrooms are allotted to your lectures and one theory part is allotted to your tutorials. Tutorials, the concept of tutorial is about the means uh, one can come in the class and uh, we can have a uh, problem solving round. Internal assessments are of 20 marks whereas the Theory marks of any the total overall paper would be of 100 marks. So MCA 101 computer architecture, 102 is accounting and finance management. This is based on some uh, commerce part. Then the third paper is database management system. The fourth one is programming in C. And the fifth one is the discrete mathematics. These are the five theory papers. 
and the four labs are MC 151, which is office management lab, which having got excellent PowerPoint and Windows. Then there is a lab of DBMS, database management system. Then a programming in C lab. This is a new thing, microprocessor lab. Microprocessor is a lab where you can make some programs for a microprocessor 8085. This is the microprocessor number. Uh, you can make some program in assembly language. Microprocessor lab. So these four labs, every lab is divided again in two parts, 20 and 80. So all the papers are of 100 marks each. So overall total marks for this semester is 900. Similarly, for MSCIT course, again each semester is divided in uh, five, five theory papers and three labs. You see the four labs, there are three labs, five and three. Uh, papers are very similar to MC. Again, 100 marks each paper. So, overall marks will be 810 each semester. Again, in last semester, which is your fourth semester in, M in MCIT, uh, there are only two theory papers and one uh, industrial project, which is of 400 marks. 400 plus 200 are uh, really overall 600 marks. So, this is the overall marks allocation for MCIT. important, uh, particularly in the field of computers, uh, the thing is the punctuality and the attendance. on your college notice board for MC course, MCA first, 
BCA first and MSCIT first. Yeah, MB also. BB also.